All right, you see that uh, ball there? That's a hornet's nest. Uh, this is, uh, well, what the hell date is it? Oh, we're into February, almost into March of 2018. And I found that back in uh, November, December, but just haven't had a chance to get back here really and get it. So what I'm gonna do to try to get that is, I'm gonna use this, uh, it's called a high limb chainsaw. Essentially, it's a weight to throw over a limb and then two pieces of rope and a piece of chainsaw in the middle. So you throw the uh, throw the weight up over the limb and then you work that chain up until it's on the limb and then you just manually pull one side to the other and cut the limb. So I'll try to throw that over right now. Okay, believe it or not, I actually threw the weight up over that limb on the first try. I thought for sure it was going to take me 10 or 15 tries. but um, So I've thrown my weight up over it. Now I just got to wiggle it until the uh, weight drops down. I can get a hold of it. And uh, just keep kind of wiggling this rope here. Just throwing it a little bit. Get it to loosen up on that. And as the weight comes down, this chain is going to be drawn up. And we'll just saw that limb off and... Get that hornet's nest, see how bad it looks. It's, it's looking pretty uh, pretty rough from here. It may not be worth saving. Okay, so you can see my chain. Uh, the saw portion is now down here by me. That's because that limb has been cut through. It actually didn't take me very long. I bet I didn't, I mean, it probably didn't take more than a minute or two. So then to get the thing down, to get the rope down, you know, the one end's got the weight on it, that end of the rope, the other end, has nothing tied on it, so you don't want it to snag up in the tree or nothing. You just pull the rope. That's that. So that's how you use a uh, high limb chainsaw. And uh, I guess I might have to get a big stick. Now we're down to about 15 feet off the ground. The limb is stuck. So I get a big stick, knock it loose, get it down. We'll take a look at it. Well, we got it down. I end up, uh, I just threw the rope back up over that limb and jerked on it and it, uh, it come down, but you know, it, it, it is pretty sad looking. Uh, you know, weather, I guess, works on these things pretty quick. So, you know, if you don't get them early in the season and I don't even know what would be too early, I'd hate to, I'd hate to go get one in the fall when the bugs are still in them, but this is pretty poor condition. Um, I was going to give this, uh, as a gift to uh, the landowner here, uh, really, really good couple. They they let me deer hunt, and uh, I just think it'd be a pretty sad looking gift, actually. So I I thought of them when I found this in the tree. You know, I was out here deer hunting in the fall. I saw it. I thought, man, that'd be cool to cut it out and give to them. They might get a kick out of it. You know, and they make a cool looking decoration or what. But I think it'd be uh, pretty pretty uh, sorry little gift now so it's probably just gonna stay out here in the woods